Listen, we live in the golden age of cybersecurity, free education and resources. There, there's just so much of it out there, but how do you know which ones to take? How do you know if they're helping you reach your goals? And how do you even know what job it is that you want to break into cybersecurity, right? It can get really complicated. It can be overwhelming, I understand. Hi, I'm Dr. Gerald Ozier, Chief Content Creator at Simply Cyber and co-author of the new book, Cybersecurity Career Master Plan, okay? I am super, super excited about this book. I've basically been in the industry for 17 years. I've done various roles in the industry. I run my own information security program now. So I've walked the path, right? I've been up and down the mountain a few times. What this book is going to help you do is it's going to help you understand you know, is a, is a job in cybersecurity even right for you, right? And once we establish, yes, it is, then let's talk about where's your passion. Let's find it. So in the book, we cover all the different roles that you could have, right? It's not just all about pen testing. There's, you know, blue team roles like SOC analyst, digital forensics, incident response, malware analyst, right? Then we've got the governance, risk, and compliance side. Maybe you want to run your own program one day. So there's risk analysis. What different regula regulations do you need to align with? And can you help an organization be compliant? Maybe get ahead of the curve. That way you can enter into business markets um, because you're already prepped and ready to go. There's a, there's a bunch of different jobs, right? But you can have that job in different industries too. So let's talk about the industries. You can work in the financial sector. You can work in healthcare. You can work in oil and gas. We cover all the different sectors that you can work in and tell you the pros and the cons of working in them. For example, financial services, it pays amazing, right? So if you just want cash money, go work there. But by the way, it's incredibly high stress because money's on the line. People yell at you quite a bit, okay? So it's a risk and reward and you have to make that decision for yourself. But the point is we go into detail in the book to give you that knowledge, okay? So once you figure out the job you want, once you figure out the industry you wanna work in, the book is going to take you to the next step, and that's how do you get those hard skills? How do you get those, those certifications that matter, right, for what role you want, okay? We're going to go in, we're going to lay out techniques that you can use, tips you can take advantage of to get the education. We even have some technical walkthroughs in here. I wrote the chapter on standing up a Raspberry Pi home lab using WebGoat as a web application platform to learn the OWASP top 10. Uh, uh, vulnerabilities. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, that's fine. It's in the book, right? Just check it out. Okay. So one of the best things I love about this book is that myself and the other three offers wrote it in such a way that it's very conversational in tone, right? It's as if the four of us plus you are at a bar or at a coffee shop and you ask the question, how do I get into cybersecurity? The book is the answer to that question but it's as if we were having that conversation. So I like to think of it as a contemporary textbook that is full of actionable, relevant information, very valuable knowledge in there, but it's not written to put you to sleep, right? It's written as if we're having a conversation. My personality is in this book. Jax, Kim, John, all their personalities are written uh, for the chapters that they wrote, so you'll get to know us too. I hope you enjoy the book. I hope it helps you. If it does, please let me know. I'm on LinkedIn. I do the Simply Cyber YouTube channel. I'm very engaged in the community. And for me, it was, it was never about money. It was always about helping people find their passion.